how has your shyness impacted your life? Imagine that if you had overcome those fears and the shyness, where you would be today. And if where you would be today is better than where you are, then you want to be willing to change. Just even getting an interview, you've already passed several of the steps that you needed to pass to make it to the interview. That means your resume was great, your pre-screening with the HR and recruiter was great, and now the last step is for you to go ahead and wrap things up with the in-person interview, whether that is a panel or a one-on-one. -on -one. But you're going to take every opportunity there is to practice interviewing. You're going to find the job description, the roles and responsibilities. You're going to take each roles and responsibility, align it to your resume where you have a experience bullet that aligns to that roles and responsibilities for the new job. And you're going to practice as much as you can. Because when you practice, you're normalizing something that you have feared in the back of your mind.